everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. First off, it's like really hot in Oslo today. It's full on summer and it's so warm in this apartment right now. So if I look a little bit sweaty, it's probably because I am. But I'm gonna film this video for you either way and then I'm gonna hit the park or backyard and get some tan. I feel like I just did this video and I feel like I say this every single time because the month go so fast. It's the end of May and it's time for my May favorites and we're soon heading into June and I'm soon only a month away from leaving for Thailand and I can't believe it. I'm so excited. In this monthly favorites I've got a lot of beauty products because I've, May was kind of an uninspired month for me so I didn't really have that much of fashion favorites because I was the weather was like snowing and it was warm and it was raining and everything so I just kind of uninspired uh, but the last week it's been much better so a lot of beauty items here I've been testing a lot of new items so we can start with some of the beauty items before I go on please don't forget to hit the subscribe button below and give this video a thumbs up if you like it and the next video will be a Q&A so ask me anything you want to know in the comment section below and I'll answer as many as I can in a video next time so leave me any question you have in the comment section below so first up is the new uh, perfume from L'Occitane. I got this one back in March. I haven't started using it until the last three weeks or something because I've been hooked on my Gorilla, Mon Gorilla perfume as you may know. But this is really good and it doesn't look like I've used it at all but I have. I've used it for like every day the last three weeks. This is gonna last me a long time and it smells, oh, it smells so good. It smells like summer. I just, it smells like a uh, park with lots of flowers and yeah just smells so good so this summer favorite for sure and I've also used oh I've almost used up my gorilla so I needed a new one and very random but a new deodorant that I've been loving it's the MIS deodorant just soft and fresh it Not much to say, but it works really well for me and it smells so good. So this is definitely worth a try. I am a huge fan of the Biotherm, Biotherm deodorants. In, yeah, I have used those for many, many years. So to love another deodorant is really huge for me, but I really, really love this one. That means it's good for me. Then this one I've used the last one and a half weeks because summer as I mentioned has hit Oslo now and it's time for bare legs and after a few months in Norway when it's cold your legs gets really pale so I've been using the Cosmica sun kissed body with um, it's a body lotion with um, Cosmica's triple moist complex that provides immediate intense and long-lasting moisturizing deep into the skin and it also has Tan, tanning effect in it so you get tan and uh, not really really like dark tan but you get a little bit more tan so you can wear a skirt and that has fit me perfect it's the smell is kind of intense I'm not sure if I like the smell but I can deal with it that day and when I shower the next day it goes away but the tan doesn't go so I can manage the smell but it smells like really tan self tan ish if you know what I mean. Then over to some more skincare favorites. I've been trying out the new skincare brand um, the last three weeks, four weeks, every morning and night and I really love it. My skin loves it as well and I'm just picking out some of my favorites right now. It's the MIS Sensitive Day Cream and Night Cream. It's I need the sensitive ones because my I, if I use the moisturizing ones, it gets too oily and when I put makeup on, it just gets too greasy. So I need the sensitive ones. But these are really, really good. And my skin doesn't break out, which my skin usually does when I switch brands. But it didn't with this one, so 
so far so good and we're four weeks in I think so I think we're good then I have a oh, then I have a few fashion uh, fashion favorites not that much but a few and then we go back to beauty again first off is my Loewe clutch as you may know if you didn't see the unboxing I will link it below and here somewhere I think um, but this is my new clutch my pink clutch and I love it I've been using it like every other day since I got it and I got it in the middle of in the middle of May, I think. So yeah, this is my favorite bag this month. And I really, really love pink, if you haven't noticed that yet. And I got, ironically, I have a new sweater that I really love. But it's 25 degrees outside, so I can't wear it right now. But it's from H&M, and it got these oversized sleeves with all the um, flowers on it. I'll insert a photo of me wearing it somewhere here, so you can see how it looks on. And I love it. It's way too warm right now, but in a few days I bet it will be colder because Norway never stays in 25 degrees for more than 2-3 days. So in a few days I probably can wear this one again. It is going to be awesome with like a denim skirt and just some simple shoes this summer. So nice. And it's in store now. I bought it two weeks ago or something. Then I got a favorite pair of loafers, which you already have seen in my London haul, which I'll also link below. This is the River Island loafers with the flower print. And as you see, I have a thing for pink and flower print right now. That's my obsession. These have been so much worn since I bought them in London back in May, earlier in May. So yeah, not much to say. They're super comfortable and they look awesome. And the fact that when it's warm, you can just slide them off when you're sitting down on the off at the office or anything that's perfect then we can move over to a couple of hair care favorites my hair from bleaching and yeah everything my hair gets really quickly damaged uh, or my hair is damaged so i use um repair deep conditioner every time i wash my hair which is every other or every third day and lately I've been using the Bjorn Accent Repair Deep condition Conditioner with organic argan oil, sea lavender and minerals. It's for nourishment, shine and strength. And this has been really great. It makes my hair look... It makes my hair super soft and that's what I need and I need hydration because this hair gets dry quickly. But this is a really good one. I usually love the Moroccan oils one but now I have this one and I wanted to try it and I love it oh i'm hungry then i got a magnifying leave-in treatment spray from eleni and chris i use this every time i've washed my hair i just spray it all over my hair and leave it in as it is supposed to be this is for uh, ideal for finer hair types formulated with heat protection indulge your hair yeah it's for heat protection in it and that's really good because I always forget to put heat protection in my hair before I use dry hair dryer or anything. So this one I always remember to use and the fact that it has heat protection is really good. Then obviously got nothing for Armani Beauty this month because I first I bought myself this lipstick. It's the Armani Beauty Ecstasy in 103. It's the one I'm wearing today and it's super soft. It's super simple to just put on and it, I love the color. It's perfect for summer. So this one is really, really nice. And I've also been loving that Armani Eyes to Kill 4 color eyeshadow palette with these amazing colors. And they are like kind of highlighted, but not like sparkly. I'm wearing it today as well, not that much of the brown one, but I'm wearing a lot of the pink and the white ones. And they're just perfect for summer. So these ones are the favorite right now. Uh, I'm going to do... Um, oops. I'm planning on doing a summer makeup, summer makeup tutorial for you guys in a few weeks. And I hope you're excited for that because I've got a new foundation and I got a new pieces that I really, really love for summer. Uh, I don't want to carry that that um, heavy makeup during summer because it's warm outside. So a little bit lighter, but still and really glowy, but still, yeah, still a lot of makeup as you might see on my face. 
So that is coming up in a few weeks. That was all my favorites from May. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give me a thumbs up if you did. And all the links will be down below for all the items. Don't forget to ask me any question you want in the comment section below and I'll answer them in my next video. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.